the men's world jumping championship at Hickstead in Sussex, the four finalists on their own horses, Hugo Simon on Lavondel for Austria, Ireland's Eddie Macken on Pele for Germany, Hartwig Stinken on Simona, and American Frank Chapeau on Main Spring. Starting on Lavondel, Hugo Simon finishes a clear round. Frank Chapeau on his horse, Main Spring, clears the water jump, and he too goes on to complete clear round. Then Eddie Macken on Pele clears the water jump and it's another clear round. Competition is obviously going to be close. Now Hartwig Stinken on his 17-year-old veteran Simona. They were European champions in 1971. He completes a clear round for Germany. From now on, the riders exchange horses. In the second round, Frank Chapeau rides Lavondel. One bar down, four faults. Eddie Macken, this time on Chapeau's mainspring, four points down, but he clears the water jump. Stinken on Pele. And it's another clear round. Simon, riding Simona, jumps clear, but still ends up with four faults. Eddie Macken starts the third round on Lavondel. And it's a clear round. Hartwig Stinken on Mainspring. Four faults. Hugo Simon on Pele. Four faults at the water jump when Pele gets his feet wet. Round four, and tension mounting as Hartwig Stinken on Lavondel makes sure of another clear round. Eddie Macken on Simona also jumps clear. So it's a jump off for Eddie Macken on his own horse, Pele. With four faults done, he races to cut down the time, finishing in 45.6 seconds with eight faults. There's a good fighting chance for Hartwig Stinken on his own horse, Simona, and he takes it easy to make sure of